Hi, my name is Debbie Hoffman. I'm an adult services librarian at the Warren Newport Public Library. Um, Tasha Alexander, if you're looking for an historical mystery, Tasha Alexander is a wonderful, wonderful author. I think the reason that I like her, besides the fact that her, well, there's many reasons, her characters are very well fleshed out. You really um, know them. You get to know them throughout her throughout her series. Um, you also um, get a real sense of time and place. I don't know if there's anybody who's doing more research than Tasha on her books. Um, they're just fascinating. Um, this one is actually her 13th. This is the 13th uh, Lady Emily series. And, um, and I want to just mention to you again, I'm, not that I'm a stickler about mysteries, because you certainly could pick this up and enjoy it without knowing any of the history. But her very first one is called And Only to Deceive. And so I would, if you, if you haven't um, read her first one or, or any of the series, I, I do suggest that you maybe start from the beginning. But again, you don't have to. So this one is, Lady Emily is um, married to Colin Hargrave. Um, Colin is very involved with the um, with the royals, as is Lady Emily, and they have spent well twelve previous novels solving mysteries um, historically. Um, Colin Hargraves is with Queen Victoria at her bedside, and he, she slips him a note that, that in Latin that says, "One and no man dare to know, one and no more dare to know." So. She be he becomes very interested in that. They're not really quite sure where this, um, what this means, what, the, what Queen Victoria is trying to tell them. But unfortunately, after that, people start to, uh, people start to get murdered. And they're concerned because they're all murdered in a style that had happened to a medieval king. And so what they suspect is happening is that the, the next king is being targeted. So um, Lady Emily and Colin are working very diligently trying to find out, trying to look for any clues that they can find to try to solve the murder and find the murderer before anybody else is hurt. I think I like this is because Lady Emily is strong, she's vivacious, she's independent, she, is, um, um, she doesn't compromise her, her methods or her um, imagination, and Colin, her husband, really appreciates that about that about her and doesn't really try to change anything and you figure this is the 1900s that she's writing about so it's very interesting to me to see this kind of a relationship at that time um, in our history this is just um, it's great it's really fun it's interesting again so much history is told in this book and um, this is called uneasy lies the crown by tasha alexander